you may remember kanin jaro reaction is given by compounds that having no alpha hydrogen and in this reaction one molecule gets oxidized and another gets reduced that is this is a disproportionation reaction for example if i have hcho and phcho treated with concentrated naoh this gets oxidized and this gets reduced so we will have salt of acid and alcohol now the two molecule that gets oxidized and gets reduced can be in the same molecule for example if i have this compound now in this case this carbonylic carbon has no alpha hydrogen and this carbonylic carbon also has no alpha hydrogen so if this compound is treated with naoh this will give kanin jaro reaction now this time one molecule gets oxidized and another gets reduced both happens inside the same molecule so this is called intramolecular kanin jaro so if i oxidize this half we will have co minus in a plus and we can reduce this half so we will have this molecule so this half gets oxidized and this half gets reduced so this is example of intramolecular kanin jaro reaction now let us consider mechanism of this reaction so in the first step we have nucleophilic attack by oh minus on carbonylic carbon so this step is nucleophilic attack by oh minus now in the next step we will have hydride transfer and this time this is intramolecular so we will have intramolecular hydride transfer so we have this molecule so we can shift this hydride to this carbon so we will have this product now next is acid base reaction so finally we will have acid base reaction and this is again intramolecular so we have this molecule this oxygen is basic in nature so this will abstract a proton
so finally we will have this product So this gets oxidized and this part gets reduced. Now let us try this problem. This is again very related to Kaninjaro reaction. This carbon does not have any alpha hydrogen and this also does not have any alpha hydrogen. So first step we will have nucleophilic attack by OH- minus. In the next step we will have phenyl shift. This time we does not have any hydrogen. So we cannot have hydride transfer. This time we will have phenyl transfer. So this is the only difference we will have this time. So we can shift phenyl group with bond pair. And finally we will have acid base reaction. This is intramolecular acid base. So lone pair can take a proton. So we will have finally this product salt of acid plus alcohol. So the compound contains salt of acid and it contains a alcohol. So this is a redox reaction. 